Welcome to Beastabilisus, the hairy beast, where we talk about everything hairy and extinct. This is the lost episode, episode number nine, which as you remember, we've collected fossils this last summer. And in this episode, we're going to talk a little bit about um, the last six months of preparing the fossils and getting them ready for the museum. So you probably remember uh, this specimen here. This specimen I found on the surface, and you just saw this, and uh, we collected it very quickly. It's in a block, and we brought it back uh, to the labs um, here at Utah State University, and we started preparing it. Um, and we kind of used a number of interesting tools. We kind of used a uh, just gluing the things together and providing hardener. And then we started to chip away at the rock itself with a little micro jacket. These are pneumatic uh, drills that kind of basically act like little mini jackhammers. They bounce up and down and they break open the rock. As soon as that fossil is exposed, we put on hardener and glue and to keep it sort of solid. So it's a long process. Um, that particular fossil took me several days of repairing it. Um, we also collected the jacket which we've opened up and started preparing and we've gotten quite a bit of it prepared. It ended up turning out to be a creature like this. This is a Prooreodont, which is a type of artiodactyl. So let me show you that, that interesting little skull that we collected and show you what that kind of looks like. So here's the box that I prepared of that skull. Um, and what you can see here is, um, here's the skull, I'll pull it out, and if we look at it, we can see there's the orbit where the eye would be, uh, and if we flip it down here, we can see sort of the palettes. So we're looking at the uh, two sides of the upper teeth. We see it has a big canine. This is a creature called Lept Leptotragulus. Leptotragulus is an early um, artiodactyl. It's kind of oftentimes uh, it may be close to a uh, basal ruminant. So kind of a nice nice skull. There's other better skulls of this uh, creature known, but it was a nice little discovery that we made on our excursion into the field this summer. 